Tokyo West Stop. Yeah, the Hyper Nights, uh, they're just such fun boards. Uh, I ride one at home all the time and they're just great for uh, small, fun waves, a little bit fat, you can actually have a really fun session on them. The ranges go from 6'9 up to 9'6. A new model this year is a 9'6. The Hyper Nut provides a little bit more forgiveness. It actually generates quite a lot of speed through the turns. So when the wave isn't providing you with that speed, you can jump on the Hyper Nut and still have a really fun surf. Yeah, that gives you a little bit more of a skateboard type of feel. You can kind of slide the tail out a little more, and but it still provides a lot of drive. Yeah, the Hyper Nut comes with a quad setup. This has been proven to be the best setup for this type of board because of the wide tail. Also helps with a lot of drive in the board, but you can release the tail if you want as well. The Hyper Nut has a, more of a flatter rocker throughout, which allows you to paddle onto waves quite easily but it has a channel down the middle of the board which provides tight turning into the pocket. I'm Donica Schaus. Today I'm going to talk about the nut. So the nut range offers the best of both worlds. You've got two boards in one. Glide in like a long board, you can ride the nose, or take it all the way back and ride it like a short board. The nut range comes in four sizes. It starts at 8.5 and uh, ranges all the way up to 10 foot. So on the nut range with more tail kick, you've got increased control and maneuverability. So the nose of the board's got a nice concave, which gives you a lot of control and stability on the front. But I love the nut shapes because they're super stable, really easy to get into the waves early but then you step back and you've got all the control of the pro shapes. 